cooler temperatures to the area. Right now in Sacramento, we're at 81 degrees with an east wind blowing at five miles per hour. So there's a little breeze in Sacramento. It's much stronger in other areas, though. From Sacramento to Stockton, again, wind wise, not a whole lot. Southwest breeze, only five miles per hour. Current temperature is 83 degrees. In Modesto, temperature in the mid 80s with overcast skies. It's going to feel kind of muggy out there. 25% humidity with, again, not much wind to help uh, with that. 80 degrees in Fairfield, southeast wind at nine miles per hour, and a lot of cloud cover overhead. So that's again keeping the temperatures down, but also raising the humidity up there. 40 percent there in Fairfield, 22 percent at Lake Tahoe, 78 degrees, lots of smoke in the air, very hazy conditions, and a southwest wind blowing at nine miles per hour. Temperatures today did warm into the mid to upper 80s, so quite a drop in temperatures. And again, contribute all that to the cloud cover that we had. 84 degrees. We've had a little bit of an onshore breeze, and so that helped uh, keep temperatures down for Fairfield and Sacramento. A couple more degrees in Stockton and Modesto. 89 was the daytime high to the Marysville area. All the cloud cover. Now, what's interesting about this is this is a com composite showing you the cloud cover, but also some radar. Now, what I'm noticing here is look at this in through Southern Lake County. I'd say that's probably more the smoke that the radar is picking up than any kind of rain that's making its way through that area. But we do have some isolated light areas of rain along the coast of California, kind of spinning around with this batch of moisture that's pushing across California. And that is going to increase the chances for some showers as we head into tomorrow. So, cloud cover, yeah, there's more clouds. In the forecast for your Sunday. As we head through Sunday afternoon, cloud cover starts to decrease in the valley, but we see showers start to pop up. And these could be some thunderstorms, some thunder showers that make their way through the afternoon around Lake Tahoe and along the eastern slope of the Sierra. Things start to clear out as we make our way through Monday morning, but then we could see some showers pop up to the south again, just right there, Stanislaus County and then through uh, Merced County. Mariposa County could see a little bit of rain through the morning hours. Forecast conditions around Lake Tahoe could see some showers and thunderstorms tomorrow afternoon. So we have that in the forecast. Southwest winds 5 to 10 miles per hour and temperatures ranging mainly in the mid to lower 80s. Uh, Grass Valley 88 degrees, Jackson 89 degrees, and Sonora. How about a daytime high of 91 degrees in the Bay Area? Comfortable. Marine layers in place. And so that's helping to keep temperatures in the upper 60s around San Francisco. We will have plenty of cloud cover, though, on and off again throughout the day in Concord and Antioch. So temperatures ranging in the 80s, mid 80s through Fairfield with a little bit of an onshore breeze from 10 to 15 miles per hour. And as we take a look in the valley, temperatures can start off fairly warm once again, mainly because of the cloud cover that we have in place, with temperatures warming eventually into the mid to lower 90s around Lodi and Stockton, Tracy could get into the mid 90s there, 95 degrees. Temperature of 90 degrees in Woodland, 91 in Marysville, 91 in Roseville. And temperatures here at Sacramento, I think we're going to be more, like, more than likely just around 90 degrees or 89 degrees, 91, kind of that range right there around 90. We drop off into the 80s and stay there in the lower 80s to upper 70s through Monday, Tuesday, and Wednesday with partly cloudy skies as the weather system moves on through to actually bring in some much needed cooler temperatures.